they're going to want to make sure you know your stuff. If you don't know your stuff, the deal's over. You're going to want to know trends of the industry. You're going to want to know what your competitive you know, intrusion will be in the marketplace. You're going to want to know who are the players, what do they offer, what makes you different, better, faster, cheaper, who that target audience is and what makes you think you're going to get some of them, what's going to separate you from the crowd as far as hospitality, quality, service, cleanliness, accuracy. You're going to want to know your stuff because they're going to ask. Think about this. An angel investor bets on the horse and the race. Just like horse racing. People who spend their time, money, and effort betting on the horses and horse racing, they figure out who the jockey is, how he rides in the rail, third post, outside. They want to know the horse what the horse is used to running in, mud, fast track, okay? Well, an angel investor is a deal maker. They're going to want to know what the horse is and who the jockey is. In the restaurant business, the horse is you. It's the exact opposite. The jockey is the concept. You would think, oh, it's all about the concept. No. It's all about you. That's what makes it different. See, in horse racing, for the most part, if I have secretariat, I could put just about any jockey on secretariat. Secretariat's going to run. I might win more, bigger span with certain jockeys and less span with other jockeys. But secretariat's going to run, and, and I'm going to win with secretariat. Well, in the restaurant business, the concept is important. There's no doubt about it. The concept is the jockey. The horse is you. Because what they want to know, can you impress? Can you work hard, play fair, do what's right, do what you say you're going to do? Do you know your stuff? Will you invest the time? Are you intense enough? to demand results? Are you tactical enough to connect all the different dots? Because see, the investors have heard what the rest of society has heard, which is, oh, the restaurant business, high failure rate, way too much risk, can't make enough money, and the host of other issues that they've been told. You have to to spell those myths. You have to be the person where they're sitting there going, <laughs> this horse can run. This horse is secretariat. And really, the concept could change because we have to change it. And this horse would not be afraid to change that jockey, the concept, because that's what it's going to take for us to make money. They want to know if you're willing to be in the black, make money versus being in the red, losing money. They want to know that they're sitting here putting their money on the horse that's going to win. That's what makes the restaurant industry different. Now